Okay, we're going to find SketchUp Make. So just type in SketchUp Make thing. Go to SketchUp Make. This is where SketchUp Make, you want to download SketchUp Make. And it's going to ask you, what do you want to use it for? to download SketchUp Make. I plan to use SketchUp for and just for personal projects. And then you have to fill in your email address and stuff, but it's free. So once you have it down and set up, then we're going to draw a set of stairs. So, would you like using this? This one right here. So we're just going to go a 7 inch rise and a 10 inch, 11 inch tread. So let's draw a line. I'm going to put a top hanger on first. So it's going to be 7 inches. And it's going to be a half inch top hanger. So go 0.5. And then back up. And then across. be a top hanger. We're going to put a nose on that top hanger just for the heck of it. So go one inch, down one inch, over one inch. Nice. Let's go. Now E, hit the E button or you can hit erase. And we're going to round that nose. To find the midpoint, go over half an inch. Press your space button. Let's put a little rounding on it, right to there. Hit your E button again, or your eraser. I'm just going to delete that, 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 and that. All right. And now let's double click on it. We're going to make it a group. OK. So that's our first one. That's our hanger. Let's do a line again. So the, our tread is going to be 10 inches. And one inch thick. We're going to have a one inch nose on it. Down one. Over one. And let's put a little dado in that nose thing. So. This is where I enter the numbers over here. So I'm going to say 3 sixteenths of an inch deep. And we're going to use half inch risers. So 0.5 and back down. 3 sixteenths. And all the way back to here. Up there. And let's round this nose as well. So hit line or hit that. So we're going to go 0.5 inches, because it's a half inch radius we want. Use that. OK, now let's erase that. Delete that, erase those, erase those, that, and that. So that's what our tread looks like. Now, like I said before, we're only going to use half inch risers, or seven inch rise, go down 7 inches, and 5, there we go. So that is what it looks like. So we're going to double click on all this, okay. Now you notice that we made this a group, so only this stuff is getting highlighted. Right click, make group. Now what we're going to do is just make this 36 inches wide, just for example purposes. So let's right click on it, edit group, click there, hit your P button for push, and just type in 36. And you can go here and just double click, and it'll do the same thing. 
to it. And then we'll close the group and we'll edit that group. And in most cases that should oh that goes the other way. So we'll just uh move that go thirty six inches as well. Okay. Look at that. Now that we have this as a group, we're just gonna put uh Make it a seven rise, so we want six treads. So hit select the group, hit our move button, wherever it is, move. Okay. So we're going to select the bottom of this tread. See how it goes up like that? So hit the control button and put it to the bot there. Then we say times five. That should give us six treads. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right. And our our dimension should be seven. So it's seven. bottom one we have to bring that up an inch so I'll just select it hey edit group and then select this hit your P button to push and then just as you're mo moving it up just enter one and there's our treads but you see these are all groups now and now we want to make a stringer for them we're just going to use 2 by 12 stringers. So I want to select all this. Hit move. Just want to bring it over, make another copy of it. Let's bring it over uh, 8 feet, 96 inches. So what I want to do now, I want to select this whole thing, right click, and hit explode. You see now all these lines are all by themselves. Hit the tape measure, and we're just going to make a reference line, and then we're going to use two by twelve stringers. And we want to go down eleven point two five. Okay, that's how thick it is. We want to go across this way. So just double click here. See how that line goes up like that? We want to bring one down too. Okay, so now we have something to follow. Since all these lines are individual now because we exploded it, we only have to make th uh, three lines. So hit our line button. Line. Down to there. Double click on that and make it a group. Okay, just so it's by itself. Now right click, edit group, and we're just gonna make it inch and a half thick. 1.5. Okay. Let's try it again. Edit group. is the stringers. I'm going to move it. Hit your shift button and slide over. Put it right there. Now I'm going to move it again. Take this end. Hit the control button to copy it. push button and just drag it down to there. So hit your edit, delete all the 
guidelines. Delete guides. And we don't need this guy anymore. And here we go. There is your stair. So we have a 9-inch run. And a 10-inch trip. 